Evergreen, what a small world, man. Seriously. You don't believe me, uh, Fiona, tomorrow you free, uh, about 4.30, you come to block 862. Are you staying around there? Uh, you go 862, you'll see my face with you. Ah. Okay. Anyway, welcome, everyone. All right. So, um, what did we do last week? Uh? Hey, oh, my goodness. I haven't opened up the file. My goodness. No, just now my camera is not working. Give me a minute. Uh. I need to open the file now. I'm so sorry. So sorry. Is it 2 o'clock? Yes, 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 yes. No, open, open. Ay, what happened today? All the phone open. Ayo. Ayo, one pay become nan rena. Chao kao. Is this my lesson too? Give me a minute, sorry, uh. I need to change something. Today is 21st, right? Okay. All right, let's start now. Okay, Fiona, I think this is your Tron lesson, the first lesson, but both of them have been with me last week. So we are talking about celebrations and festival, right? Ching Yang, right? Remember? Did we go through the festival? Yes, right. Uh, yes. The, which festival can you recall and maybe share with Fiona? Uh, it's the... Uh, wait. I just realized what I can sang is Xiao Bai Tu. You're born in the rabbit, right? Right. Are you in the, mm. in the rabbit here? Fiona? Yes. Yeah. Because my daughter also born in the year rabbit. But she's older than you, 12 years old, sorry. We talk about the festival in Singapore, right? Agree? Did we talk about Wenpei? Can you remember now? Yeah, the festival of the Hungry Gold Festival, the Tuan Wu Tie. When one of my students, Fiona, had tell me Zhong Zi Si Burger, I was like, excuse me? I got one student tell me that uh, the massage is very cute, Wenpei. I love it. May continue to put that. Uh. <laughs> okay. You see, Wenpei got a massage there. Okay. So uh, leave it to that. Wait, don't, don't, don't change. Uh. Very interesting. Okay. So what is festival and celebration? Did we go through? Did we talk about it? Did we write down? I can't remember. Uh. Ching Yang, did we go through that? Uh, yes. We write down, right? Yeah. Okay. Okay, let's go. Let's be honest. We're going to bring out the different festival from around the world and tell me which one is the best. Let's go. Wenbei, can you read to the class, please? Let's be honest. Traveling the world is only as fun as the exciting adventures you embark on and the few experiences you have as you discover foreign cultures. Festivals are a great way to have a fantastic time with others while engaging with local customs in a tangible way. Not to mention it's an incredibly easy, fun way to spice up your sightseeing plans. Second paragraph, please, my Each year, there are tons of different festivals around the world to choose from. But don't fret, we've got you covered. We've craft crafted a list of the best festivals in the world, so you can prioritize and start planning your dream trip sooner. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Is this recording, uh, Ching Yang? Is this recording? Recording, uh? Uh, yeah, it is. Okay, thanks. Uh, you and you, I know you're not free today, so you're watching the video, so... Uh, Wenpei, are you from MGS or, or Sending? I can't remember. Sending. Sending, uh, okay. Hey, my dear, don't read like that. How's that like a lawyer? Big block, big block, big block. I want right, to get my flat, be honest. Okay, read, read properly, my dear. You got a good voice. 
Okay, you have to win. Remember, you are not here for set one, set two, three, or four for O level. You are here not for A level. You are here to prepare for university. You are PIS, professional international student. Fiona, if you guys tell me you're a Singapore student, you're evergreen student, please get out of my class. You are international student. You are university. Okay, meaning that you complete your university here. Now, I would like to ask all of you, okay, my class is a bit different. Now. What is the meaning of five up? Since you are reading this, Wenfei. Well, I mean, why don't you say fun way to lighten your sightseeing, to improve your sightseeing, to beautify your sightseeing, or to increase your sightseeing? Why spice up? Uh? Anyway, uh, Wenfei, I cannot eat spicy food because I'm not hot enough. I'm a cool guy. Uh, any problem? Excuse me. Uh, I'm not, I know you all, the three of you are very hot good guys and, 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 and girls. But Uncle Pu can eat la. I eat la. I will go to Japan. I will go to Hiroshima and Nagasaki. I will eat it. Why do you use spice out? You do, don't forget. Oh, sorry. Uh, uh, you're not in, in Evergreen Express class, right? Yeah. Can you see that? Can you see that? You just know you're a nerd face. <laughs> hey, come on, guys. Do you want to be a nerd or do you want to be a naughty or do you want to be a notorious three N is Jen? Can you see a nerd, ma? Right? Not that you want to be. Hey, so we lao da. Anyway, uh, Fiona, are you staying around in uh Emirati area? Okay, good ah. Uh. If you're free ah, uh, next this Saturday, this coming Saturday, uh, Uncle Rima will be at the at the MR at the at the Emirati M. One more time, I will be there at the Emirati MRT station doing my police duty. You thought Emirati station means you police man that place, right? You see that? You see? Ah, I will be there. Don't believe ah. Uh? 27 I will be going to decorate my shell. You don't believe? Come and see. Seriously, if you are staying around the area, because I'm doing my police duty, by the way, I'm a police officer, but okay, volunteer police officer. So why spice up? Because you want to make it better. Remember, there are five senses. When you're writing an essay, you want the, the, the audience, the reader, the examiner to say that you more so you feel good about it. So when uh when I say when you say I want to spice up my life, so what does that mean to you? Come, I'm starting my lesson. I want to use real life example. Oh, please, I'm not going to follow MOE just to get A one. Uh, no, please. Uh, I think it's not time to do one pay. Don't cover your face, ah, yo. Cover your face for what? Such a pretty girl and cover your face. Come on, Tingyang. Oh, uh, you want to make your life more interesting. Um, do you think it's a good answer? No, honestly, you say I would like to spice up my life. You think it's a good answer? Uh. Yeah, you er uh, means not sure, right? Er uh, means you not confirm, right? Never mind. Hold on. How about when pay? When some is uh, when you tell your mommy, daddy, or or next time with your husband or your or whoever your boyfriend, I would like to spice up my life. So what is it? You want to like make your life more interesting. Uh, hello, brother. Same as Ching Yang. Nah, okay, so God. how about Fiona? Make a life more fun and more with more activities planned. Well, well very smart. When you hear your two friends saying like, oh, so Uncle Raymond don't like this answer. I'm going to write, I'm going to give a long answer, smart girl. Uh, if you ask me, your, all your answers are definitely correct. Uh, using your own words. Remember comprehension, you have to use your own words, right? Uh, uh, my best answer would be, uh, if I want to spice up my answer, my life will have three V. V, uh, v for Victoria. My life will be victorious, will be very vibrant. It will be very victorious, very vibrant. And what is the third V? Very, very, very interesting. Uh. <laughs> Uh, use the word very, very. Uh, excuse me, only one very. Uh, not very, very. You better call it very, 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 Now, the V word is actually to help you to make it more interesting, right? Spice up. But you say, uh, my life will be interesting. Hello, uh, Ching Yang. Uh, you secondary school already, huh? You are no more primary school. So, primary one, primary two say, teacher, I know spice up means very interesting. Of course, got more. Now, Ching Yang, don't mind. Uh, if you are going for A level next time, right? When your 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 teacher or even in university, what is the meaning of spice out? Well, professor, spice out there are three different meanings. One is to spice out the food. The other one is to spice out how my life is going to be. Whether it's the FML, finish my life or freak my life, or the other word will be F my life. 
the third spice out will be making things more uh, more interesting in life to see how it works. And sorry, uh, Fiona, if you were to say this in the school, teacher will say, oh, you're very defiant, no? you use all the wrong words, no? sorry, this is MOE. I used to be teaching in MOE. I'm an ex-discipline teacher, all right? I got students ever say the effort in front of my face. When I say effort, really effort. Huh? But today, he's one of the quite a rich man with a very cute baby and I saw him in the Facebook. And guess what, Fiona? The whole entire body, very nice, got a lot of tattoos. Please do not judge a book by its cover. Okay? You and I are not God. So later we look at the various festivals. And you tell me, there's one festival I hate. Really, I love this one. Oh my gosh. Guess where is this place? Uh, definitely it's not me. Huh? Guess, guess, come on. Can you unmute and be fast? We've got a lot of things to share. Hey, this is I'm going to take my hand to get my I'm going to take my hand to get my hand. I'm going to take my hand to get my hand. Hey, which country? Which country? I know, just Singapore, I tell you. You tell me Singapore, I've been there. China. Huh? China. China. Good. Wenbei. Uh, it friends. One. Right. <laughs> uh, my friends. Thank you very much. Uh, Charlie. Ah, uh, Qingyang. Uh, Italy. Italy. Ah, uh, Yuan. Oh, sorry. Yuan is in video. Cannot see. How you know it's Italy? Ah, uh? because you print out the answer, right? Yes. My, my mom already printed it out. Can, can you be safe the environment? Bloody hell, emotional damage. I told you don't print the paper because you cut down a lot of trees. Can you do Italy, Venice? I will tell you. Uh, this one in the way I talk like Uncle Roger. Okay, now I talk like Uncle Raymond. So what happened to Italy? Venice is exactly the old city level in social study. Venice used to be 1,000 years independent until Napoleon came in to attack Italy. Can you imagine that 30 days of festival? Like, 一个月不用读书了, 整天玩, 整天跳舞, wow. Hey, seriously, uh, guys, one day you got married, uh, please bring your spouse for honeymoon. Uh, you must go to Venice, my mom's favorite place. You know Venice is sinking? You know, right? Because of the global, uh, global warming, all these things. Then you must ask me a few now, hey, uncle, why you tell me all this? Uh? For what? Uh? Can you help me in my, my A1? Uh? Yes, of course. This is real life. Okay? In real life. Since you mentioned that, uh, give me a minute. Uh. Just finally, I think of it. Uh, think of it. Uh, okay, guys. This one, uh, uh, I'm actually doing another business with boss. Okay? So what are you going to have here next month, especially Qing Yang? Uh, if you're a good boy, okay, hand in your homework, like you pay attention, I like won't pay like that, change your massage, all these things, I love it, I enjoy it. You will get this voucher. This is all my ex students, um, no, sorry, existing students. These three persons are now sex for, they are with me for three, four years already. And this is my books. Are you looking at the pop in, Fiona? Are you looking at the pop in on the screen? Are you looking at the pop in now? Yes? Okay, so what you get now, won't pay and Qing Yang. Next month, if you continue to do your homework, you will get this $10 in your handphone. And then you go to the shopping mall at Plaza Singapura and Anchor Point, if you're staying there. The third popping will be coming out somewhere in the east side. You will get a $10 voucher. Instead of $10 popular voucher, you guys will get $10 either a Starbucks voucher or this voucher to find anything you want. Okay, as long as you complete your homework, you participate here, you turn on your camera, you talk to me, you scold me, whatever, I don't care. So you see, they get the book and get the, this teddy bear, and this one get the book and get some ear ring. Okay, and some of them last month they came for my uh, year end party, uh, and we gave, okay? So all works and no play make you a down girl, so please. All right, thank you, uh, Venice. So now, uh, Ching Yang, are you ready to read these two paragraphs? Now, there is a trick to for this. Uh. When you finish reading this paragraph, my dear, can you find one word? Let's go. Ching Yang, go. Uh, Carnival de Venezia or Venice Carnival dates all the way back to the 11th century but came to international acclaim in the 18th century. During the weeks dedicated to Carnival each year, thousands of tourists and locals take to the streets in beautiful costumes and masks to enjoy dan 
to enjoy music, dancing, parties, and all, all and the festive atmosphere. Festivals, wait, festivities also include live theatrical plays, featuring intriguing and comical traditional folk characters, lavish eighteenth century style glass in beautiful old Venetian buildings. So it's pronounced open, Benetian, 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 Ven sorry. Venetian buildings. Open air street parties and award ceremony at carnival's closing to celebrate the very best costumes and masks. Very well read, good voice, good rhythm, but it can be improved. My dear, first paragraph is in each, you say in and the or Tasuni. Go on, say in each, you 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 say in each, very good. This paragraph? Uh, theatrical. Okay, so you have to use dedicated and theoretical to form a sentence like this. Okay? You see that? You saw the example, you print out the example already, right? Okay, these are my set two students now. Huh? They are with me for one year already. Huh? Okay, get it? You will not learn this in school, please. So do not share with your classmates. Okay? Right, thank you very much. Next one, uh, we don't need, okay, just go quickly. It's from India and Nepal. So back to you, Wenbei, would you mind read to uh, the class? Please? This is the second festival and celebration. I'm talking about international. So Fiona, if you missed out last week, if we are talking about festival in Singapore. We are talking about Dibabari, Hari Raya, uh, Duan Wu Tie, uh, Zhong Yan Tie, which is a Hungry Go Festival, and also Chinese New Year, Christmas. This is local, but now we're talking about international. Let's go, man, your turn. Bali is undeniably one of the biggest religious festivals around the world. Without the Festival of Colors, Bali is a springtime celebration of all the good prevailing over evil. The festival also marks the end of winter and the anticipatory celebration of the abundance of the upcoming spring harvest season. For locals and tourists, Holly offers a chance to play, dance and sing without a care in the world. Commemorated each year on the day after the full moon in March, people send the, people spend the day smearing richly colored powder on strangers, friends and relatives, throwing colored water at each other and dancing underwater sprinklers. Great emphasis is placed on Hindu tales about the burning of the demoness Halika and its, and its relation to the festivities. So Holly celebrations are kicked off by large bonfires, complete with singing and dancing on the eve of the festival. So my dear, you choose one word from here, okay, and one word from here. So may I, uh, Tina, so can I take away now, uh, this one, uh? so I put your name. Uh. So you give me the two words later. So this is uh, Wenfei, uh. then this is Yona. Okay. Later you give me the words, all right? Thank you. Where is it? Okay, so uh, my dear, can I choose now? Two words. Really just? The first one. Uh, the first paragraph? Yeah. Religious, is it? Yeah. Okay, the second paragraph, please. Celebration. Thank you. Okay, so these are the two words. Huh? Next one. This one is definitely in Brazil. Okay, Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. And it's on the Ash Wednesday. By the way, if you do not know Ash Wednesday, is usually celebrated by the Catholic myself. 
I'm a Christian and I'm a Catholic. The Ash Wednesday is where the people put the ash on the forehead. And then you know that it is different from India. The Indians people put the, the dog here is for their Hindus. This is for the Christian Catholic. So it's a bit different. Are you ready, Fiona? Let's go. You also printed the paper. Ayo, <laughs> no need, la. guys. Please, please don't print the paper. Don't. don't. You see, sometimes I got 30 over pages. Sometimes there will be answers blocked away, okay? So you get what I'm saying? Now. Sometimes the answer will be blocked away. So it's no point you print. Because after print already, I honestly, will you keep... I'd rather you to put in a PDF format and then use the phones or things like that. But if you insist to print, I don't stop you. Huh? Please, I won't stop you. But so far, not all my students, after a while, they'll stop printing already. But it's okay. Huh? I don't stop you. But if you're talking about social study and history notes, I guess, you need to print how. Huh? So don't get angry. Huh? Let's go. That's not carnival like cryo carnival in fact it is my dear your, your microphones is not very good this is talking and not like lagging trust me yeah it got that kind of sound ah uh, so uh okay ready one more time there's no impossible to think of Brazil's capital city without thinking of its carnival Carnival as Rio de Janeiro, Janeiro presents it is one of the most interesting and well attended cultural celebrations around the world. Even though the festival's origins are in ancient Greek, revealed honoring Dionysus, the god of wine. Over time, Carnival was Carnival was modified by the Romans to honor two of their own gods, and later the Catholic Church will make its own modifications and have festivals celebrated just before the period of Lent. But, uh, okay, but it's still the volume, like, right, right, agree, uh, Wen Pei and Qin Yang, uh, you can agree, uh. that thing is not clear, but it's one and distorting. So I'm not sure you're using your laptop microphone or a separate microphone so some of my students bought a big microphone very clear some using this one like a gamer's uh, headphone uh. okay what is a land uh? a land is like a, when jesus was going to a desert and 40 days that kind of thing then when the devil was assisted he said well if you are god if you trust your god turn this stone into bread so this is where before jesus was being crucified on the day that is called the good friday I think none of you are Christian, right? I think one thing you should know in sending is a Catholic school. Huh? So every Friday there will be chapel. Is this still on? One thing. Is this still on? There's chapel. Uh, you're not Christian, right? So is it true? Is this still on? The Catholic girl will go for chapel? Yeah? I'm not sure. Huh? You mean your whole class, nobody go for chapel? Huh? All non Catholic? Huh? No, I haven't asked them yet. No, 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 but on Friday, when you see some of your classmates disappear, no. do you know where to go? They never disappear. Oh, because I told you my girl was in standing, huh? so all the Catholic girl must compulsory attend the, the chapel huh, on every Friday. So I also from a Cochran Presbyterian Christian school, huh? so every Friday we have to attend a, a, a church service. Huh? All right, so let's go. Thank you. So which one are you choosing later? Huh? Next paragraph, please, Fiona. I hope your mind is working well. Rio de Janeiro has earned its title as the carnival capital of the world with its famous samba dancing, colorful eye-catching costumes, pulsating music, magnificent float displays, and electrifying energy. Join a samba school and dance, sing, and let loose at one of the best festivals in the world. I'm not sure is it your Wi-Fi or is it your you're using a laptop, huh? The, a laptop, huh? I'm not sure your what your laptop, the mic is it good or not. But just now the first time you read it's okay, no? But now a bit that sound. Okay. My dear Fiona, please choose one word for the first paragraph and another word for the next paragraph. And the three of you please send your answer to Zoom chat now. Wait, why I why I stop sharing a clown? Okay, now let's go. 
Uh, which of the words, Fiona, the first paragraph? So you have to type your answer, uh, the three of you, you have to type your answer. So uh, whatever the two answer, you the two words you choose, like Tin Yang, you have to form into one sentences. Get it? Uh? You know what I'm saying? Tin Yang, you mean by what You understand? Good, thank you. So, so which two words, Fiona? Interesting and eye-catching. Oh, you want to choose eye-catching and this one, you are, what? I didn't hear you. Uh, interesting. Interesting and eye-catching. So put these two words together now. Okay. I will uh, come back to this one. Huh? See? So what? Uh, what what, do you, what is the first word? Interesting. Interesting. And the eye catching. Okay, can you form this into one sentence? Hey, why I put the plus? This one I think is religious, right? And what? Uh, I can't remember it. Sorry. Wenpei, I can't remember. And uh, this one is what? What do you put? Uh? Yang. Okay, never mind. You just type your answer uh, now. Oh. Type your answer now. The two words. Come, let's go. In one minute, you must come out your sentences. This is to test your discipline, your devotion, and your passion, and your concentration. So within one minute, you must give me the answer now. Go. Type your answer and share with the group, please. Thank you, Wenpei. Uh, girl, you are set one, no? you are not primary one. No? Nothing wrong with your sentence, very good, but not good enough. Every sentence, Fiona, must be child to 15 words, please. <coughs> so you you add celebration, is it? Religion and celebration, ah? Uh? Okay, very good. So can you add a bit longer? Thank you, my dear. Wait, Mr. Raymond, do we... Oh, 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 yeah. Now, you see that, you see, you see, you see, may I help Wenpei to add, uh, religious celebration are held all over the world, and can, can I put this, uh, and enjoy by millions of what? Wenpei. So, capital letter, we start with, by millions of what? Different people. By millions of, well done. Because to the power one. Fifteen. Yeah, you see fifteen words. Well done. That is why I say uh when pay don't share your friend. Twelve to fifteen words. Oh my goodness. Well done, Jing. Hey, Jing, which school are you from? I forgot it's all right. Uh Chongqing. Oh Chongqing hi. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Have you seen the twins already? Have you seen the twins twins, the set two twins? No ah. Uh, what city no. are you taking? Uh I don't know yet. If you take Scout, you will see him. Huh? If you take MPCC, you will see the other things. Huh? You know now you know how to play the game? The audience clap after the dedicated actors perform gracefully and exquisitely in the this theoretical traditional theoretical play. Well done. So both of you, well done. Later, we're going to play sabotage game. You know what sabotage? Huh? Wen Chia, ask Wen Chiang. Qin Yang, you're going to sabotage Wen Pei. And Wen Pei, you're going to sabotage Fiona. And then Fiona can sabotage Wen Pei. Okay. You won't play this game in school. Huh? Okay, come. Hello, Miss Fiona. Are you ready to write your sentence, please? Thank you. That's very fast. Huh? Well done. Every country has their own interesting celebration along with eye-catching costume. Wow, sweet. Ah. Piao liang. Ah. Very good. Eh? Okay, now we'll go back to the next one. Huh? 做我们比较少学生，就有多一点机会表现你们的才华。Okay, I tell you, ah, uh, 
I don't know about you. Uh. I won't want to play. I want. I won't want to join this festival. Uh, seriously, Ching Yang, your turn. No need to ask you which country it is because you already print out so no fun with it. Uh. So that's the reason. Next time I must cover it. Uh. Okay, Ching Yang, let's go. As usual, huh, Ching Yang, you choose one word here and one word here. Okay, let's go. And girl, girl, Wen Fei and Fiona, tell me later after Ching Yang finish reading these two paragraphs. Do you still want to join this March festival in South Korea? Go. Mr. Ching Yang, will you mind read to the class, please? Can you hear me? Ching Yang. Ching Yang, can you hear me? Yes. Ah, can you read to the class, please? First staged in 1998, the Boyong Mart Festival is a fairly new festival celebrated in the coastal town of Boyong, South Korea. It was originally a uh, conceptualized, 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 provide PR for a range of cosmetics created using the nutrient-rich mud from the area. But the festival quickly became Korea's most popular summer festival. Now, Boyang Mud Festival is just a great excuse to get down and dirty and have some fun. Oh each, year year, as each year, festival goers head to Daechon Beach for rocking live music, a way in the nutrient rich mud, and for a chance to try out various mud related health and beauty products and services. Immerse yourself in nutrient run rich mud at the mud pool, sit down the mud site, or embrace an artistic site by body painting with colored mud, make your own mud soaps, and challenge yourself on the mud maze obstacle course. So you're playing with the mud, your whole body sweat like hell, and then you, your, your underwear maybe filled with the pee smell, the what shit smell, and the whole body, and you still want to put the mud on your face. Ah. No, I don't think I want to enjoy this this one. So uh boy, same thing. Let's go. Choose one word each. Thank you, sir. If we're done, can you type in the Zoom chat later? Huh? Which word first word is what, my dear? Ching Yang. Uh conceptualize. Thank you. Wow, good, huh? You choose those difficult words. Well done. Number two? Uh emos. Where, where? Immerse. Ah. So conceptualize yeah. and immerse. Okay. Thank you. One pay your turn. Oh, I tell you. Okay, good, good, good. I would like to drink with these two girls, not this guy. But sorry, I will never want to drink beer because I don't like alcohol at all. Not a single tip of alcohol. But if you ask me to throw yen, yes, I will smoke. But because of my smoking habit, ah, it caused my three children to have bronchitis, uh, asthma, and and a problem with their skin when they were born. So you can't tow in super how the so me uh, this one is in Germany, October fast. And by the way, uh, this is also very important. Uh, when they, um, just to take note, uh, uh I told you I got a few ex-students from Sandy. Uh, one of them they use it for social studies. So take note about this October fast. It's very important. Later when uh Wenbei is reading this, you will understand why it is so important in Singapore, right? Ready in three, two, one, let's go, man. Munich, Germany. Uh, wait, uh, can I bring down this one so that it can read easier? Let's go. Two paragraphs. Well, telling a story already. Once upon a time in uh, 1810, in 1810, a German crown prince married his princess. The kind royals had plenty of festivities for all the townspeople of Bavaria. Munich. <laughs> Munich. Munich. Munich to enjoy and everyone had so much fun they decided to do it all again next year and the year after that thus October Fest was born and now when people think of the month October they think of the chilly weather pumpkins and of course October Fest you realize uh, they don't say uh, they don't say they think of the cold <coughs> excuse me they think of the cold weather they use the word chill chilly yeah uh. Okay, that's the advert to describe how the weather is. Because it's so damn cold, they need to drink beer to keep themselves warm. Uh, sorry, I prefer warm milk. I told you, I don't want her alcohol. And because of alcohol, 
I have a very sad story behind it. So I don't want to bring it up. But uh, yeah, it caused one of my friends to pass on. On an average Oktoberfest brings on average Oktoberfest brings six million visitors to Munich each year and so it is fair to say that it is easily one of the biggest festivals in Europe and enjoys immense popularity worldwide. So much so that across the US Oktoberfest celebrations have been replicated in a number of oh, okay. major cities. Oktoberfest brings together aspects of a rich local culture, history, and fun, fun and games, good food, and great beer to make for a few weeks of awesome celebration. Head to the what? Reason. Reason. Reason, yeah fairgrounds to enjoy agriculture shows, costume processions, fanfare rides, historical and cultural displays, all the food you could possibly eat, and of course the copious amount of beer Oktoberfest is famous for. Okay, go like Jen Jenny Oh, <笑> 那种小女孩嫁给那些有钱人哦 Entire world to know. She can't hear us, never mind. I mute her not to talk and not to listen to her. So Ching will be looking at me, Uncle, you're very funny, huh? Oh? These are very lame jokes. Okay, by the way, uh, joke aside, 6 million people is equivalent to Singapore population. And in Singapore, there's this October fest. Seriously, it's in October. And there are a lot of German residents in Singapore. How I know? I know lah. Because I used to work with people like them before I was a teacher, I worked in an IT firm. And how I know? I know lah, because if you don't believe, if anyone stay in Jurong East, there's this building called the German Center. Okay, if you know this German Center, and German Center, and by the way, if your parents or any of your relatives were to drive this kind of car, BMW, Mercedes, Audi, and Volkswagen, these are all made by Germans. And you know all these cars here will definitely have engineers and spare parts. You can see how big it is. So this festival to them is one of the best. I realize no no racist and no things um against to anybody. Uh. I, I don't know. Maybe the three of you can do the research, huh? Because this is all, all the way not to your set four, but all the way to your university. I realize woman the Asian culture, woman the celebration festivals uh, in my opinion, uh, we have more than the Western. Western three towards the Thanksgiving, Independence Day, Christmas, Easter, uh what else? Halloween. Woman uh. No, Indo is a hundo chaser. Thai Kuo is a sorry, Indonesia, um, Vietnam, uh, Cambodia, Myanmar, um, Taiwan, you name it. Uh, okay, hundo festival. And we, I feel that because to them, uh, since their festival are quite limited, uh, I may be wrong, uh, I'm so sorry, uh, but not, not 100%. Uh, they have to celebrate their festival in really good one. In Malaysia, uh, they also celebrate the Sultan birthday, the Agong birthday, which is the emperor birthday, uh, so-called. So in Japan, of course, they have their, you see. So you realize that Asian culture, I'm so sorry, uh, guys. You, your set one history is not doing ancient history. I'm uh, very sad. Uh. The past I taught history in set one is taught about the ancient civilization of the India, the China, the Huanghe River, the Egyptian, the Indus civilization. Now, uh, set one, uh, correct me if I'm wrong, Fiona. You're still talking about the separate reference and found Singapore, right? 
啊，他整天放放不完哦。那个可怜那个 Stephen Raffles， give me a break man， come on man。喂，听讲我说喂 ，Stephen Raffles 喂 ，for Singapore William Farquhar come to here say sign happy happy， then 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 OK OK Singapore here British found Singapore， then after that you talk about how Singapore is attacked。For the two years, you just talk about Singapore, and you don't forget primary school social study also talk about Singapore history. I yo boring ah, sorry ah, MOE I didn't mean that. Okay, come nice stuff. Ah, okay, share that. Okay, this is the one ah I cannot take it ah that I will never never enjoy to participate. It's called la tomatina. That means tomato lah, Fiona. Okay, now let's read. This is a celebration I will respect, but I will never enjoy it, and I don't think they should do it. Lam face Lu. Let's go. La Tomatina is the ultimate food fight festival held every August in the town of Uno. Uno. There are many variations of the origin story for La Tomatina. Ranging from harmless pranks among children to attacks on an awful mu musician to townspeople expressing their anger and disappointment with city councilmen. This friendly fight and quirky festival is well attended. In the past, in the, past the famed uh, La Tomatina has had as many as 50,000 attendees, but in more recent years, a ticket system has been introduced to keep the number of particip participations at low or below 20,000. The hour-long battle begins with the firing of water cannons immediately after which chaos in and and ensues so with over-firing with over with over one hundred tons of overripe tomatoes being squashed and flung all over. So um, please get used to me. Uh, every time when you all finish reading a paragraph, my job is to explain to you. You have to ask me why I need to do that. I really know how to do it. Why are you explaining to me? Reason number one, I always give three reasons. Uh, I don't give two reasons. Reason number one, I want to enforce, enhance, and ensure that my students know to read paraphrasing the paragraph. For comprehension purpose. Reason number two, I do that because you guys are going to have oral presentation to your, your teachers in the old level, two minutes. So I'm teaching you how to talk. Reason number three, where we phrase it, you kind of reflect back. How am I going to use it for my editing, for my composition? So you see, this is how I teach when I was in Kochan as well. Same thing. I make sure that I'm teaching not just textbook context, but in real life application. Ready? I imply to you so that you are able to apply in your study so that you can supply your answer to the exam. Then when you wait for your reply to get A1, imply, apply, supply, and reply. Do your best with all your zest. Beat the test to win the rest from east to west. Please do not try because you will cry. Please choose two words. Now I can you say 100 times eh? That means they purposely keep the tomato until they run out of them. They like one game. Chitan Gao. Chinyang. You don't see the sun, you see by one room, you don't see fun. You can't do tomato soup, you can't do tomato what, right? They put it like this. And you see the metal door, 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 the metal door. Fiona, recently, the bull come and tell me, Chitan Gao. 我这只牛很可怜，每次给人家擦擦擦，擦了要死了。他们做牛排吃，你可以跟 S P C A 讲吗？然后我是属鸡的嘛，哎，对不起，呃，牛老弟，这 S P C A 是在新加坡，西班牙没有 S P C A， 对不起。可是这是虐待动物哦，呃，对不起，牛大哥，我无能为力。啊，有买拉粉，反正哎，啊，啊 ，You see。I want to make it a very funny joke because I'm being sarcastic, uh. right? Seriously, I mean, sorry, they they'll tell you, hey, this is my 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 way of festival and celebration. Who are you to tell me, Raymond? And they even put the bull running out of the street and then start hurting people. Who are you to tell me? But over the years, I heard through my research that there are people going to step down, cutting down of this. 
but very hard, lah, my dear. Sorry. So, which are the two words, Fiona? Ultimate and introduced. Ready? In three, two, one, the three of you, don't put the shark, lah, you. So ugly, you put your face on the shark. You put the mustache, will do, my dear. <laughs> okay, let's go. We continue from here. Oh, by the way, by doing this, it's also helping you in the uh, essay. Uh, last year, Fiona, one of my students who is now set for this year with me for three years, he told me uh, this question came out in their prelim exam. In set three. Celebration time. Come on. So there is a possibility. All these topics that I've chosen, one way or another, it may not come out this year, but it may come out next year or things like that. But you definitely... Over the years, eating way through the oh, you came out already, huh? Okay, let me see. Wow, you are not quite the beautiful and powerful queen. Ah, not you, man. Okay, shh. Not you, ah. You see, that beautiful queen, ah, not not Wen Bei, ah, the beautiful and powerful Wen Bei married a famous historical person in nineteen hundred. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, Fiona Qingyang, Wen Bei took a time machine to come to Singapore. Oh, then you might love, uh, Uncle. Can I can Yeah. Hey, come on, guys. Fiona, look at my look at look at the screen now. Look at the screen. Think like a freak. Think like a freak. Go and go and Google it. Download this PDF. A few of my students bought this book. You will change your life, man. Think like a freak. Thank you very much. Uh, I like the way Ching Yang put it this way. Can you help to do it the next one uh, like that? Okay. <coughs> Thank you very much. Wenbei. Uh, Fiona. What are the two words, please? I can tell you, uh, yesterday I was doing my policing job. Uh, okay, so one of my friends was telling me, he said, hey, Raymond, I think uh, in 2026, there will be another pandemic coming. And then in 2030, uh, there will be World War Three coming. So how? If it's 2030, World War Three, Xinjiang, you'll be going for army. Uh, so you're going to defend Singapore. No? <laughs> Thank you. Uh, yes, may I have your Xinyang? Can you read your sentence, please? Xinyang? Newly, the newly conceptualized VR headset allows you to immerse yourself in a different world. Hey, do you know the Samsung 24? Uh, the Galaxy Samsung 24, now uh, if you Talk in Korea, they can translate in English, no? When you, let's say, I call my friend in Korea, say, uh, or someone, I want to make a reservation for a, a, a table of four, they can convert it and translate into Korean. Then the Korean will read, in uh, say, in Korean, and then when they send the message to you, they translate into English, the AI. Wow. Uh, anyway, I'm a, I'm a person, I don't use iPhone one. Okay, my whole family iPhone, I'm not iPhone. I Oppo, Xiaomi, I China product one, sorry. One Wei, can you read to the class, please? One more time. The queen changed to your name, huh? No. <laughs> the queen changed to your name. If you have no violence objection, let's go, Wen Pei. <laughs> she asked for it. <laughs> okay, come on, don't be shy. Let's do it. Let's go. The beautiful and powerful queen married oh. a famous historical person in in nineteen hundred. Their marriage was smooth and happy and had a happy life. Why do you add this? And they live happily ever after. The end. <laughs> okay, well done. Oh, that's a fairy tale, man. Well done. Ah, <clears throat> uh, your turn. Fiona? 
scientists introduced the ultimate cure to cancer in the year 2015. You can add on a few more words. Scientists introduced the ultimate cure to cancer in the year 2015. Hope, right now, hope this will be a breakthrough. You know the breakthrough? Two, four, six. Hope this will be a breakthrough. Yeah. Fiona, when you wrote this sentence, I feel very sad. No, serious, serious. No, no, sir. First time in my life, I attend a funeral, la funer funeral last year. A funeral. Via Zoom. Why? Because my cousin passed away of cancer. I think it's breast cancer in New Zealand. So there were a different time zone of four hours. So I have to wake up a bit earlier. Was it earlier? Yeah, to attend the funeral via Zoom. So, and the best part, my cousin daughter, my niece, uh, she's a doctor, Ethan. Okay. And uh, the year before, one of my friends also died of cut. Uh, my good friends, uh, Fiona, uh, also died of cancer. He was my mentor to me, taught me how to do prayer. So every time I see a cancer, hopefully there's a breakthrough. Uh, maybe a uh, Maybe you are Dr. Fiona, Dr. Wenpei, and Dr. Qing Yang. Okay? Don't laugh. Eh? If you don't believe yourself, if you start shaking your hand like that, please get out of my class. Eh? I don't like negative. Eh? I prefer positive. I think Fiona, you agree. Eh? Our life is full of negative already. So it's good to have more positive. Because your parents have really suffered so much in their life to bring up to you, brought up you today at the age of 13 years old. So it's time for you all to pay back to do a good job for them, right? Especially your mommy, yeah. Then imagine your mommy when the period of time when she gave birth to you, how much blood she lost when she gave birth to you. Wow, thank you. We have not done it. It's very painful. Young children, have you ever seen it? I have seen You might look at me like that because I do the operation before that. Okay, come, let's go for this one, huh? So I don't agree this one. How about this one? Young are you ready? The water, yeah. the Shonkao Water Festival. I don't like this also, seriously. When I was in Thailand, my whole body got wet. All even my underwear also got wet. Damn it, man. Let's go. To celebrate the traditional New Year, Thailand's Songkran Water Festival is had, held every April all over the country. But Chiang Mai's take on Songkran is legendary and not to be missed. After all, it is the most anticipated holiday in Thailand. So if you want to go to Thailand for holiday next time, uh, Yang, make sure you don't go in April. Uh, okay, even though their ticket is very cheap. Uh, because you go there, uh, they start splashing water on you, putting the powder in the water and then soak you. Can you imagine your whole underwear and your whole t-shirt smell like, oh my goodness, seriously. I regret going that time. But it's very fun, uh, to be honest, because it's, it's their new year. Uh, Qingyang, it's their new year. Uh, they are not uh, Vietnam and China celebrate the, China, the new year on the same. But woman the Sprinkling water has always signified for Thai people blessing, purging and newness. In this fresh take on old school beliefs, persons of all ages come out armed with super soakers or buckets of water really to soak strangers and friends alike. Festivities include bubbles, performances from professional dancers, religious processions, and other fun ways to keep cool. Okay, go. Choose two words. Uh, anticipated. Thank you. And blessing. Thank you. Start now. Think of a sentence. This is my second best place to go. Harbin, China. And I got one student. Don't love, huh? Uncle, what happened now? Uh, since these are all made of ice, what happened if the person go in there start the, the things the ice melt? Uh, will you be covered by ice? I say, come on, man, please. Logic, right, Ching Yang. It won't just suddenly melt and then brah, come down, right? Turn off, you're not at one place. Then just like you drink cold, uh, the ice will slowly melt and then become water, right? And I obviously I I, I disturb it. You feel your solid liquid and gases are uh, fine. It takes a while to evaporate, right? How okay, can it straight away melt and the whole thing collapse? Come on, go, please, please. Oh, yeah, huh? True, true. Okay, let's go. 
Are you ready? It's your turn. You know who, who are you, huh? Go. The Harbin Ice and Snow Festival is an annual thematic winter festival that takes place in Harbin, China, and the largest ice and snow festival in the world. Harbin Ice and Snow Festival provides the visitors each year a whole new wintry world of ice and snow. The city's northeastern location in China allows for natural and abundant ice and snow, nicknaming the city as Ice City. As the ice Thank city. you. Next one. Not only is Harbin recognized as the ice capital of China, but Harbin is also renowned for its incredibly ex exquisite ice and snow sculptures. The Ice and Snow Festival is preceded by the Ice Lantern Festival. Nevertheless, the Ice and Snow Festival remains the highlight and most beloved ice event in the country, as well as one of the best winter festivals in the world. Do you know, my dear, the last part of the three sentences, even though you're sitting like that and reading, uh, okay? Honestly, uh, when you come to oral reading, uh, I don't like my students to do like that or sit like that. I want my students to sit at 90 degrees straight, uh, the projection of voice. But do you know when you read the last three sentences, it's much, much better, surprisingly. Uh, so I think, uh, Wunbei, I leave it to you. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong. Last lesson, you told me you don't like to read. read uh, then good luck to you. There's no what? point. Were you the one to tell me you don't like to read a lot? No. You like to talk a lot, read like. Uh, I like to read. Oh, good. Then why are you having a voice like, I don't know. You, you, you will think what to so good. We have a vision for tomorrow. Hey, please. Lively. Okay. Bring out. Okay. The last three sentences, the way you read is good. The tone, the voice is sharp and good. Okay, uh, girl, two words, please. So is there another girl? Annual. Anniversary? Annual, all right. Annual, and then this one? Festival. Thank you. Thank you. Last one. Oh, this is iron. Uh. Don't com confuse with the northern iron. Uh. So, Fiona, this is in iron, Republic of Iron. It's called the St. Patrick's Day. The clover leaf. You remember the clover leaf? Uh? Let's go. This will be the last one. The rest will read as normal. Let's go. St. Patrick's Day is a cultural and religious celebration held every year on March 17th to mark the anniversary of the death of Ireland's patron Saint St. Patrick. The day also commemorates the arrival of Christianity in Ireland and celebrates all things in Irish. Since 1996, an entire festival of parades, fireworks, in general, revelry has surrounded the March 17th celebration of St. Patrick's Day. Enjoy traditional song and dance. Watch musical street theater shows. Grab some beer and get decked out in all green as you celebrate Irish heritage and culture. Different towns and cities host their own street parades and celebrations that are memorable and exciting. But Dublin's St. Patrick's Day is the common favourite. So St. Patrick's Day in Ireland is, if you look at the map, uh, Ireland is mostly a Catholic. Uh, and the Northern Islands are mostly Protestant. And Northern Ireland belongs to Great Britain. And Great Britain consists of four countries. Please write down. And we call it Great Britain or equal to United Kingdom. Please don't confuse when your friends say, I come from Great Britain, please ask them the four countries. Ready? England, Scotland, Wales, and Northern Ireland. Are you going to write down? Because you need to know. Huh? Okay, United Kingdom, you know already. Huh? Seriously, Qingyang, you know already. You know? Great Britain consists of four countries. Wenbei, you know? Fiona, you know? Four countries, I repeat, huh? the four countries is England, Scotland, Wales, and Northern Ireland. This is considered Great Britain, the United Kingdom. Okay, when they, if your friends or and when you watch, I mean, when you're reading a passage, they say Great Britain or United Kingdom, please identify which country. Okay. So, uh, yes, 
Which one you're choosing for first one and second one, Yona? Anniversary and memorable. Thank you. Okay, you may start thinking of it. Huh? Uh, this one is uh, at Guantanamo, it's in Central America. Okay, the arrival of Spanish Guantanamo in 1524 also brought the tradition of the Semana Santa, Holy Week, to the Latin American country shores. Centuries later, the tradition continues with Guantanamo having the district, distinct pressures of hosting one of the most elaborate Holy Week celebrations in the world. Wow. Now, Guantanamo is in Central America. They got North America, Central America, and South America. When you say America, it doesn't mean United States of America. If you say North America, it consists only Canada, Mexico, and USA. The Central America is one of them, it's Guantanamo. The South America consists of Brazil, Argentina, and these are the countries. Huh? Don't confuse it, please. Leverage flows intricately design complex and huge religious processions and colorful elaborate religious displays bring thousands of people up to the street to celebrate the spiritual and the culture. Simana Santa makes Spanish tradition, Catholic faith, again, the Catholic faith and indigenous culture and belief to create perhaps the most highly anticipated week of celebration in Guantanamo. Holy Week is the week leading up to Easter Sunday, commemorating the crucifixion, which is the, when Jesus was nailed on the cross on Good Friday. And resurrections when Jesus died after three days, his body go to heaven. And is celebrated with strict expressions of strict of faith in the form of different processions with their own truth. Let me explain to you what's the difference between Christian and Catholic. Huh? So one day you are in a Catholic school, right? St. Nicholas. Do you know when you when sometimes you I'm not sure your principal is a Christian or not or non-Christian, but I will not accept it if it's a Christian school, the principal is not a Christian. Huh? That's my own belief. Okay, I cannot take it. Huh? When I was young in the secondary school, all the Christian Catholic schools are run by all Catholic priests and teachers. Now, Catholic will do this. Look here. A Catholic will do this. In the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. That's Catholic. We'll do this. For a Christian who is not Catholic, he will just say, Amen. That's a different. Huh? And... A Catholic, the cross itself has Jesus on it. Well, the Christian, the cross itself has no Jesus on it. So if you see my this cross here, there's a Jesus on it here. Okay? Too small to see, yeah? You can see a, a Christian, okay? So what I'm telling you, I'm not asking you to be a Christian, huh? I'm not asking you to be a Christian. I'm asking you to identify what is a Christian and a Catholic. Now, all Christians come from Catholic. But because of history, they will break away from Catholic and they form their different Christian churches. Okay? So I give you an idea already. Yeah? Now we end the things already here. So let's... Okay, I already give you the answer for this. Uh, by right, it's not. Uh, sorry. Uh, it's not for you. Uh. And there's also a test here. But there's also an answer given since you are printing out. So no point. Uh. So uh, that's why I say I don't want to let you print not because of that. So it's my fault. Lah. Okay, never mind, we got a lot of tests to go along. along okay, so let's go for this one and then we go through so my last one. We still can do the test until we read now. So Chinya. Chinya. Oh, I spelled your name wrongly. I'm so sorry, man. Thank you, Fiona. Thank you, Wenbei. So which one you're sending? Uh? Oh, you did it the way the, the other one, huh? Okay. Okay, let's go. Uh, although the highly anticipated event did not happen, it was actually a blessing in disguise. Why? Uh, good sentence. Very good sentence. Why? 
imagine you are writing this essay. Imagine this is a comprehension passage. How are you going to anticipate what the authors and writers are going to write? Due to what reason? Due to what answer circumstances? That deal was a blessing in disguise. Terrorist attack. Agree? Terrorist attack. Do you know many years ago, there's some terrorists want to bomb Yishun MRT station? Seriously. Okay. Even now today, uh, when I'm doing police duty, uh, like yesterday I was doing police duty in my Kati MRT, uh, I, my eyes are watching around where people are carrying bags to make sure, you know, things like that. True not? Safety is very important. So, right, Tinyang, it can be because it's a blessing because disguise because, you know, a few years ago, uh, during Christmas uh, Tinyang, in Indonesia, okay, there was this uh, Christmas celebration, right? Somehow or other, these people, the terrorists, uh, put bomb in the church. Not, sorry, one church, many churches. So now anticipate this uh, that some people will make sure that the event goes smoothly. Well done. Uh. Okay. Well done. I'm not saying the terrorists are uh. well done by forming this sentence. Extra bonus for you. Thank you, sir. Next, Wenpei. Really? Wait, no. The annual moon festival, also known as the mid Autumn festival, is held every year on the 15th day of the 8th month of the Chinese lunar calendar. It is celebrated and enjoyed by many. I like the way you pronounce the R every year. And then the day, and then lunar calendar. It's nothing wrong, uh, Wenpei. I know your school might be very stressed that sometimes when you pronounce the word like very uh, the annual moon festival, also known as the Mid Autumn Festival, is held every year on the 15th day of the eighth month of the Chinese lunar calendar. It is celebrated and enjoyed by many, including the one and the fat and ugly old Uncle Rin. Prima, do you know my cousin? Uh, my cousin is Albert Einstein. You see, my cousin also very ugly. Uh? Uh, well, Fiona, you got racist. Uh. Why? Albert Einstein cannot be my cousin. Uh. Why must we all, the Chinese, must be my cousin? Uh? Wunpei, be yourself. You have, I told you thousands of times, I will still tell you, you have a good voice. If you're going to read like that, sorry, you will not do justice to your beautiful voice. If any, sorry, uh, Wunpei, sorry, I uh, don't have feeling. Uh. I have to use this word. Uh, because I know girls' school will sure have a lot of bully and, and some things. Uh. I'm so sorry. Uh, if any idiot will tell you, hey, stop pronouncing like a uh, lao wai, stop standing, hey, hello, can you talk properly? Please ignore that idiot. I'm telling you right to your face now. Because I have students come to me. Mr. Raymond, Uncle Raymond, the way I talk like that, somebody asked me to shut down. Wenbei, I got a few students now, they bully in the school and the school. When they read this, they say, hey, shut up, idiot, don't read like that. They dare not to talk, no. Uncle Raymond, Uncle Raymond, they dare not to talk, no. They dare not to talk, no. I have to take a while to build the confidence out. Who are you to judge whether my student can pronounce it or not? How they pronounce? I'm, I'm working in the real world. Can you imagine, Wenpei? You have a beautiful degree and you cannot pronounce properly and read properly. 对不起,大哥,没人要请你做很多东西的. This is a real life. Huh? 你长得好看,你什么都好,当你讲话的时候,你没有那个articulations, huh? I'm so sorry. People look, huh? MGS, Raffles Girl, Hua Chong, Catholic. Huh? All right. If you can learn it, the pronunciation is not going to be like that. You understand? Don't be afraid. I'm going to help you, not going to hurt you. If you think I'm going to hurt you, I'm so sorry. I have to say something. Seriously. Very good voice. But you see, Ting Yang, thank you. You are still like a baby voice. But slowly, you will break your entire effort. Ting Yang, okay? Slowly, your rhythm, you need the rhythm. Uh, Fiona, I'm so sorry because your cam, your microphone, I uh, really got difficulty for me to understand. But your voice is okay, uh, But because of your this, the you know the mic. Ah, uh. uh, uh, can you go back to the other one, Wenpei? The 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 enemy one. Ah, uh, no, 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 no. This one agree lah. The other one, the guy. Ah, uh, keep this one. Thank you. Let's go. Miss Fiona, why are you angry with me? He's very angry, right? Look at his face. Look at her face. Very angry, like. I'm sorry, ah, but don't look at me so angry, you see. Oh, hey, Ching Yang, if you want, I won't pay, you see. She's very fierce there. 
I'm asking you to read. 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 I'm asking you
but the apple tree gives him the inspiration. Uh, can you write down write down the AIMS for me, please now? AIMS, please write down on the piece of paper. The A stands for aspiration. The I stands for inspiration. The N stands for motivation equals success. It's your aim. Ching Yang, are you writing? Hello, Mr. Ching Yang. I can't see you. Are you writing? Yes. So why is the A, Ching Yang? Where's the A? Where's the A stand for? Hello? I can't hear you. Quick day, I got 15 more minutes to go. Wunfei, where's the A? Aspiration. Thank you. Where's the I, Fiona? Inspiration. Can you imagine, huh? Your, your boyfriend tell you, Fiona, you're my inspiration of my life. He said, oh, yes, good to it. By the way, got this song uh, by Chicago. You don't believe you go YouTube and type inspiration. Uh. It's a very nice song. Okay, and uh, what is the end? Motivation. You realize that aspiration, inspiration, motivation equal to success. Without these three, uh, good friend with you, uh, you do small thing to get 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 they say, Uncle Raymond, can you help me to buy Taylor Swift ticket for me? And last month, uh, last month uh, I have a party with all my students. And when he came to my party, I purposely played the whole entire Taylor Swift song for him. He was so happy. Oh, that's Taylor Swift song. Then you know I said, no, that's Uncle Raymond's song. You know what he said to me? Get lost, Uncle Raymond. Don't disturb me. Okay, now, may I have the next one? Uh... Ching Yang, can you read to the class, please? And then Fiona changed the sentence as well as Wen Bei changed the sentence. Go. Whether yeah. it's a small family gathering or a grand national event, celebrations bring people together and create a sense of joy and happiness. Let's go. Chang Ti, whoever can read first, you win one point. So Fiona and Wen Bei, let's compete. That the Ching Yang and I will be judged to see which sentence is better, okay? Do, do we say it or type it out? Uh, good question. Up to you. Oh. Yeah. Fastest fingers first or whoever speak first. But make sure the sentence must go. Don't, don't copy. That means you have to change that. You have to change the, the, the words or sentence. Huh? Or, you get what I mean? Huh? Wow. Challenging. Huh? <coughs> yeah, I tell you. Huh? You do this bit by bit. Huh? By the time when you go to your exam in October, you are beefing up your brain cell already. Because no student in your school will do that. Trust me. It's very tedious and very stressful. But I'd rather you stress now in January than to stress in September. Can I? There's no answer. This is the answer. You have to rephrase it. So can you change the weather? It's a big family. Can't you change the small to big? Oh my god, seriously, Fiona. <laughs> Are you a Singapore student? Whether it's a, a small big, big gathering, family gathering, or a, or a gathering between friends, celebration will get people together and give them a sense of joy and happiness. But joy and happiness, you know, ma? A sense a of what? A sense of how to say sinful gun. Peace. Peace. Can we have peace? Oh, oh, is that a peace? Yeah, okay. And peace and what? And belonging. Yes. And no, we are talking belonging. Peace and what? Peace and quiet. Good. Peace and uh. Peace and how do you know us? Peace and Oh my goodness, brother. Oh, peace oh. and health. Oh yeah. Uh, 你的华文好吗? Yeah. AL? One. Uh, 来, 
，你听过七步诗吗？有。啊，煮豆燃豆什么？煮豆燃豆须，同是根本生。你懂谁讲的吗？就、呃、那个曹操，曹操的第二个儿子，忘了名字。对，因为他他的大哥以为他要抢走他的王位，对吗？他就用这个七步诗里面讲出这么好的、这么有内涵的话。哦，来，近朱者什么？近朱者赤，近墨者黑。你知道这个意思啊？啊。还有嘞，啊、呃，还有一个，嗯、呃，《弟子规》你懂吗？知道。前面是什么啊？别、呃、不要讲，我我讲。《弟子规》说人性，说孝悌，恭敬性，泛爱众而亲仁。我们爸让我们背整个东西。<笑>对呀、啊，我跟你讲，其实这些《弟子规》《三字经》全部都很有意思的，把它改成英文说法是很有意思。改是我们再聊 ，OK？Very、okay? good. Uh, next, uh, Qingyang, your turn. Uh, Fiona, can you read the, this one to the class, please? And Qingyang and Wenbei will, will change it. The reason? The reasons behind celebrations may uh, vary, but the essence remains the same. To acknowledge and appreciate the good things in life. Let's change. Come on, Qingyang and Wenbei, go. The reasons behind celebration may be different. But... Very good. But the the wait the the the, the wait. What you say, Tang? That 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 that. Man, the you have seen come up, come up. I can read it. You want me to read it? The meaning, the meaning remains the same. To appreciate, to to be grateful. I mean, to acknowledge and be grateful for the good things in life. Ah, quite good. Not bad. Not bad. Well done. Okay, Qingyang, your turn. Oh, the reasons behind celebrations are different, but uh, the feeling uh remains the same. To uh acknowledge and enjoy the good things in life. Well done. The purpose behind any celebrations. May have different thoughts and view. Nevertheless, the importance always remains the same throughout. In order to ensure that beautiful things will always flow through our life, we must have celebration time. Come on! Oh, you might think, Uncle, it's really just a song, lah. 你不信，你去 YouTube 带 Celebration， 这个是我的年代的歌。你们讲 Uncle Raymond， 你不是周旋白关还是 Elvis 吗 ？You realize that all the old songs are very beautiful. By the way, I wrote songs before. Okay, okay, this is how you learn English. Well done. You just change this entire passage in your own words, man. One of the most common celebrations is birthday. Why do I change? One of the most common celebration is not birthday. One of the most common celebration is all the different types of festival. Each year. People can you say each year different culture, different type of race commemorate the day when they were when they were not born ah because it's not birthday when they were getting together together. You see, 明白吗 Don't share this with your friends because this is way the way you do it. Okay, Fiona, I hate math ah. One pay and Tina, I hate math. Okay, I give you five seconds ah. If you cannot answer me, I'm mute. Ah,、uh. you cannot answer me. That means you feel mad. Ready? I'm mute. Ah,、uh. all of you. Ready? I give you this bad question. Ah,、uh. I think you know. Ah,、uh. two times two. Oh. <laughs> Ready? Second one. Ah.、Uh. Hmm. One point four five nine times seven six one. Yeah, 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 yeah. Huh? One one point four five times seven one. You have to use calculator, right, Fiona? My student less than ten second without calculator, he can tell me the answer. You know? Huh? Ten less than ten second, but he's an autistic boy. Yeah, so that's something like autism. Uh, let people IQ very high one. My my last time usually sorry. Your what? My my last time usually teacher she's also autistic, but then her son also, but then her son ah、uh, very smart. And sorry, oh, this society oh, 看不起 autistic 的人，你知道吗？
我的学生这个这个学生在 NUS top 嘞 ，distinction 里面，可是他出来找不到工作，很可怜哦。周文贝、Fiona、金阳，我们要对每个人一视什么？一视同仁。You are not God. If you want to continue with my student, disrespect all people. Be honest, sincere. And truthful, right? So you see, you can change, right? Ready? I I skip ah. Uh. This one is very fun. This is your homework ah. Uh. So design an architect and plan your situation writing. Your friend from Australia is coming to Singapore to visit you. Let's say Chinese New Year lah, can? So select three places. One is Chinatown. One is uh maybe MBS Garden by the Bay, Orchard. You decide ah.、Uh. All right. So next one. This is a very fun game. So the now is one of the longest river in the world because the answer is given to you already. So now, can I play this game? Ah,、uh? trust me, very fun. So Ting Yang, you want Fiona or Wen Pei ah、uh, to do number two, one sentence before this sentence or one sentence after this sentence. So I put this one ah.、Uh, the now is one of the longest river in the world, right? One sentence before the now river is this. I did not know that one of the long. I did not know that now river is the oldest river. As the now is one of the longest river in the world, I managed to get this answer through my geography textbook. Get it now? Get it now? Okay, we we sabo ah.、Huh? So now Ting Yang, you sabo your two friends. Who you want to start? But usually the sentence before is very difficult. So who you don't like? Ah, <laughs>、uh, I don't know. Uh, uh, uh <laughs> you wait, Nan. You know, <laughs> he's a Hamlet.、Uh, <laughs> you see the two、uh, guys, the eyes are looking at you. Ah,、uh? hmm. You go, 小心一点啊 <laughs> uh, Wen Bei. Wen Bei is before or after. Uh, after. Oh, so Fiona, good luck to you. <laughs> One sentence before. This is the most interesting book I have ever read. So, the first before that sentence, you have to say. You can use Chinese to say. I think I want to introduce this book to everyone because. Translate in English, Fiona. 我看了这么多书，我觉得这本书啊，你懂吗 ？One sentence before go. I have read a lot of books, and I think that this is the most interesting book I have ever read. Continue from then, Wen Bei. Therefore, I would recommend it to all my friends. So therefore, I would recommend to all my friends. Well done. Okay, now number three, ah,、uh, Fiona. Now you stable your friend now. <laughs> Who you want to do before the spider? Tingyang. Tingyang before or after? Before. Okay, I what? <laughs> what? You from 不报悲君子 Okay, so Tingyang. Um, spider, spider. Uh, uh. <laughs> <coughs> well, we are starting to see. Uh, contrary to common belief. If you can answer, you mean you 打倒 Fiona 了没 Come on, you cannot answer. That means Fiona win you, right? This is the next time we play this game, ah.、Uh, when Yuan is coming back, ah.、Uh. If Yuan is listening, ah,、uh, you know how you play this game. No school, no class, or no tuition will play this kind of game. You make you learn very fast, Ting Yang. Uh, 传说传说中，蜘蛛精。<laughs> 师傅，我来了，咱们把蜘蛛精给干掉吧。呃，青阳好像那个唐三藏。快点，青阳。呃 ，contrary to common belief, a spider is sometimes more frightening than a large snake. Continue, 文贝。Every time I see a spider, I would run away. Okay, thank you very much. You see, not difficult. Now, Wen Bei, number four. Who you want to sabo? Myself. 
<笑>你有的啊。Okay, You know how to play the game ready, huh? And don't don't play this game with your friend, oh. Don't ever play this game with your friend. You know why? The moment they know, ah, they will learn very fast, triple fast, ah. Especially you can use in your science, in your math, in your history, in your geography. Trust me. Okay. Yes, Chingya. Next time we can play the uh, compass of life, anything or so. Ah, come, Chingya. This one is really hard. They are not hard. Really? No, it's not hard. It's in fact quite easy. It's not difficult. You, I, I, I help you out. In my school, uh, in my school, many teachers, I'm telling you. But, oh, I'm telling you, this teacher, this teacher, hey, you have you ever felt like that? In the bus, you hear the teacher talk, you're going to sleep. Then you ask your friend, hey, recess is not done. 他也十分钟哎呦好像很久嘞哇我们真的是在生疏咯但我们要应征啊叮叮叮叮啊这么快啊你先生啊你感觉啊<笑> I sleep every time uh, during his class. I feel very boring and therefore I sleep throughout the class. Okay? 我觉得很无聊,没办法,是最终我去找周公。你懂谁是周公吗? 周公就是睡觉咯。Number <笑> five. Okay, back to you. 请让报仇。也不要这样了啊。Uh, 无人费。uh before oh okay go go okay you're not get ready huh? after huh? in order to wait no wait wait you realize that, uh, sorry, Wenbei, when you do this in order to wait, wait, wait. Same thing uh, when you're writing your essay, uh, all of you. Uh, so sometimes you got this habit. Hey, put, 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 in order to make space for the cars, a bike path is usually narrower than the lane of a road. We are talking about geography in Singapore, right? Land limited space, oh, well done, it's true. And you can see Singapore now is making a lot of uh, bicycle paths. Back to you, Fiona. Uh, uh, so a bike's width is narrower than a car? Yeah. Not very good. What? Not very good to be honest, huh? Uh, you should say as a result, when as the result? biker is cycling on the lane, he must be very chaosy. Oh yeah. Right? Uh, so, so, so a biker must be very careful while cycle cycling yeah. on in the lane. In order not to knock road. down, in order not to knock down what the pedestrian, right? Yeah。你知道,你記得那個bicycle跟情人到在一起的哦。啊對對對,lot。對,在如果你去Marseille還是Amsterdam,很多人。And yeah. oh, we stay now, very dangerous, huh? Well done. Okay, number 6, your turn to sabo now. Uh, Fiona. Okay. <laughs> I don't know why they both could be bad. Uh
，情要死，演出 number six， 你讲话要小心哦，这个是跟女孩子有女人有关系的。<笑>呃，我呃，青羊 before 我们被 after， 呀，青羊来，我早就知道我一定是 before 的鸡蛋糕。<笑> uh, I heard before 啊，我们被 about the Voldemort PFT 啊 ，Is it a game or something like that? One of my few students also typed on this. I can't remember what it said. Okay, 青羊。呃、uh, ，due to some 呃、uh...。For prior experiences, people say women are more polite than men. Wenbei. That is why I usually talk to more talk usually talk to women than men. You really man? Okay, uh, Ching Yang and Uncle Raymond, we lock off now because she she doesn't like to talk to men. Bye, Wenbei. Uh. For me, ah, I don't agree. Ah, I think now women are more strong, more bold. Oh, we these guys are more gentle and nice. Hey, Fiona and Wenbei, there's nothing wrong. Wait, 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 wait. Do you want to give our men a lot of respect? Look, my grandmother, oh, very poor. She's a poor woman. Right? Do you really want to give your head to her? Can you imagine if you give your head to her? 一百年前呐、啊，我跟你讲啊，你们就是做丫鬟呐、啊，没有书读，对吗？又给男人欺负。现在啊，你看你们女孩子在这边啊，新加坡的女孩子 number one， well taken care。你看在别的国家那些女孩子被人被那些欺压，种族欺压，所以就 thank God。啊，那个是女儿国了，我也知道。师傅，咱们去吧。<笑>哎呀，那个是四五公，而且我猪八，猪八姐很喜欢去那边的，好多女孩子啊。呃，猪八姐就是这样。OK， right， thank you for the sharing 啊， all of you coming out very active to share。Now last but not least 啊，文贝， your turn to sample for number seven。You see more people coming in 啊， will be more fun 啊。OK， so this is a warm up 啦， guys， don't mind 啊， because you are one lesson behind already， so I have to speed up a bit faster because every month of Fiona and the rest。Every month I have different topics, so next week is the last week of the month, so we have to stop the celebration and and festival. And next month will be a more difficult topic, right? Let's go, Wenbei. Oh, um, Yang first, Fiona second. Fiona is after, huh? Yeah. Okay. Uh, due to having much more. Features, a computer is much more expensive than a pocket calculator. As a result, Fiona, I help you. Ah, Fiona, I help. As a result, continue from there. As a result, I will. As a result, I will buy a calculator, a pocket calculator instead. Instead of a computer, yeah. Yeah, now you get it. Ah, uh, as a result, therefore, after some thoughts, I have decided to buy a pocket calculator because I have a limited what? Limited what? Limited, uh, pocket money. Ah, uh, budget. We are done. Yeah, you see, you get it now. So how can this what you have learned? So quick one, ah. Uh. So what have you learned today? Jing Yang. Ah. I learn about uh different festivals and also creative ways to uh elaborate on a sentence. That's right, and use it in real life, oh, very important, ah. So one thing, what have you? I'm sorry. What are the two things that you can take away from here? I learned to like. What are the two things that are interest you oh, that you can take away from here? Yeah. The complete sentence thing. The sabotage lah. Yeah. Is it the sabot? The sabot lah. We call the sabot game ah. But it's very interesting. It give you alert right? How three months will be. You train your brain. It's just like two times two four. But Fiona, if you say two times two four, you take ten second to count one, two, three, four. Good luck to you. Do not Fiona. So we need to train our mind. You you see, you have to compete with. Don't forget ah. O level, you have to compete with thirty thousand people taking O level lah. 
we are talking about those good school, uh, okay? I'm not saying Evergreen is not a good school, uh, don't mistaken, uh, or, or, or Senate or, 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 or Zhongzhen. Uh. To me, every school is not a good school. To me, every school is unique. Uh. Every school is unique. If you ask me which is the good school, uh, the best school, uh, Raffles, uh, of course. Agree, uh, Raffles, Hua Chong. To me, it's this ACS, St. Joseph Institution. To me, uh, to me. Sorry, uh, I'm not saying the rest. Senate is one of them. Okay, let's be honest. Okay, so uh, Fiona, how are you going to apply in your English and what are the two things that interest you? Uh, uh, you can use Chinese to speak, no problem. I'm listening. You can use Japanese to speak, you can use French to speak. You can use Korean to speak, you can use Chinese to speak. How can you apply from today's lesson? <laughs> I can apply the the thinking skill used in the Sabo game. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. So, uh, what are the two things that interest you for this lesson? The the Sabo game and uh the the part where where we have to choose a word from each of the paragraphs we read and then form a sentence to read. Trust me, uh, uh, thanks to Fiona mentioned this one. Uh, trust me, uh, because the word that you choose from the paragraph, eventually, uh, you uh, do comprehension of the you will find the key sentence, keyword. When you find the keyword, you are in line with the question. So you will not answer what? What will you answer? Chen Yu. So I will answer. 你就会一针什么？一针见血，你就学到会熟能什么？生巧啊，表达对不起，我要 show off my 成语。哦哦哦哦，我只是少了这个，哎，不用紧，我给你看另外一个。哦哦哦哦哦，哦，我可以用这个。啊，不要笑啊！这个扇子是我我的朋友在中国，在一个宋朝的地方买的。因为你老师我是姓宋，唐宋夜明清的宋。谢谢大家